I want to show you how I update my Sony A7C firmware from version 1.00 to 2.00 using my Intel MacBook. I will also point out what's needed for Apple Silicon Mac. First, Google Sony A7C firmware update and click on the link you see here on the screen. It must be from Sony.com. Next, click on ILC E7C or look at the camera icon. Then select System Software Firmware Update version 2.00 for Mac. As you see me scroll through this page with the information on how to, you won't have to. I will do it on this video. Just follow me by continue watching the video. Before you update the firmware, they recommend that you use a fully charged battery or have at least three bars left. Also, remove the SD card before starting the update process. And do not connect the camera to the computer yet. Now, let's go back to the top and download the firmware. It will take you to sign in for download, create an account, or download now. They recommend that you create an account. If not, download now. Do what you need to do to download, and you'll see this white screen. This video is sped up here and there. Please pause when you need to. When it's done downloading, click on the DMG file. Double click on the system software updater and select open. Enter your Mac password. Here's the first and only problem. You need to install Sony camera driver. So go back to the download page scroll down to here and select for which computer you have and download download close that and open the driver unpackage the installer just continue and install enter your mac password again This pop up, just wait. The installation was successful. Close it and move it to trash. Go back to the browser and close it. Open the DMG file again. Connect the camera and follow the instructions. It will take 10 to 15 minutes. Make sure your computer do not go to sleep. You'll see these screens on the camera while running the update. Again, this will take about 10 to 15 minutes. Make sure your computer do not go to sleep. Just move the cursor around. Your camera will eventually reset. It will check the old version, replacing it with the new version. This is all sped up for you to see. After a while, the update process has been completed. Go ahead, hit finish. Here on your camera screen, press playback button and select enter. You can now turn it off and disconnect. You can turn it back on to check to see the new version. Press menu, press function button several times to see set up one screen. Press right on navigation key several times to see set up six screen. Scroll down to version and press the center button. And here it is. Version 2.00. That's it. Thank you for watching. Do come back.